get into a little bit of like your story personally about like kind of where things were at leading up to like coaching starting and like kind of like the hell hole you were in. I've been dealing with this since I was like 12 years old. Like I've been having body image issues and a really, really terrible relationship with food for like as long as I can remember. So I was trying to repair that. You know, that's kind of where I was. I wanted to have a better relationship with food. I wanted to take care of like my mental health. Like, so leading up to coaching, um, I was, I was kind of just in a bad place where I didn't know where to go. I didn't know where to start. I, yeah, I felt a little hopeless and yeah, I just feel like this has really been like, it's transformed my life. And I don't say that lightly. How bad was it? It was really bad. Like when I say it was like a binge restrict cycle, that's where, that's how I felt so hopeless. I was in this never ending cycle of like losing weight, gaining back all of the weight. And then some, you know, really terrible, like body image issues. And it, it was like, I was starving myself. I was trying, you know, cause like it's, I listen to all these other types of people like online telling me that I need to be eating less than 1200 calories a day because I'm short. And How tall are you? so I'm 4'11. Hey, <laughs> so, <let's go. laughs> so it's like, well, you're so small, you need to eat like a like a rabbit. Like yeah. you need to just nibble on a that. carrot all day and then that's all you can have. And it was like, no, like I can't do this. I just can't. But like in your case, you've been able to eat way, be completely well-fed, but at the same time, you've been dropping inches and fixed your relationship with food, stop binge eating, and then have, like lost weight on an accident. That almost sounds like too good to be true. <laughs> it is. I mean, but that's the thing. That's the most mind blowing part of all of this. It was like those, like the aha moment. Like I remember Abby would email me one day and was like, Hey, just see that we've increased calories. Your weight's going down, like losing inches. And I was like, how is this happening? It's like, how? I don't understand it, but I, I'm not mad. I'm physically fitting better in all my clothes. Before I started this program, I was one of those people that like, if I, you know, stepped on the scale the next day and it was like a pound up, I would be like, all right, I'm throwing everything away. This is, how is this possible? Like I barely ate yesterday and I'm gaining weight and whatever, screw it. And now I'm like, this is natural. This just happens. This, this is okay. I, cause it's like, I know my clothes are fitting better and I know I have Abby there in my corner and she's reminding me of this. Like this is, this is normal. This is okay. And we almost want to see it. It's so amazing. Like I can't, <laughs> I can't say enough good things about it because that's that. what I needed because yeah. it's unsustainable to go. So like to exercise so much, and eat so little for so long. This is so sustainable and eating the things that I want to eat has also been like huge to me. Was there like a defining moment or was it just like you ended up over here? I think it was the time when Abby did reach out to me and say like, Hey, your weight's trending down and we're yep. increasing calories. Yep. And like, like that was the moment where I was like, Oh, here it is like on paper. Like here it is. Here's the proof right here. And it was, it really was that aha moment where I'm like, oh, I like actually weigh less than I did when I started this and I'm eating so much more yep. and working out less. I was at a point where I'm just like, I, nothing else is working. I am again, like I said, like feeling so hopeless. And I was like, I really trust Abby. I trust, you know, I trust her judgment. And it kind of was, I was like, listen, screw it. Like, I'm just going to jump that. in. I'm going to dive in head first because I committed to this and this is what I want. And this is something that can transform my life. And if there, if you're telling me that you can, it's like, I'm going to believe it. I'm going to do it. And, and, and it really has, it's like, I'm just going to keep going. I'm going to keep going and I'm going to take what I've learned so far. And, you know, I'm going to continue with Abby's support, just kind of working through whatever is going on in my life and just like kind of. I'm dedicated to this and I'm going to keep going. I'm exercising because I enjoy it, not because I'm trying to make up for whatever I ate yesterday. I'm like eating all of the foods that I love and really just kind of like listening to my body. If, you know, say I don't know how many calories are in something, it's like, it's, I don't even have to think about it anymore. And it's incredible to finally come to that point after 10 years. How long have you guys been working together? How long, how long has it been? 
three months. Dear God. <laughs> Is there other areas in your life where that you're noticing it's making a difference as well? Yeah, definitely. I mean, just the social aspects. Um, I, I'm not scared to like go out and enjoy myself. So I'm, I'm literally happier. I'm doing more with my friends. I'm like, I feel like I'm living and I'm not, you know, being controlled by food anymore. If that makes sense. You have what Um, we call freedom. I have freedom. (laughs) I'm free. For real though. (laughs) Seriously. And it's like, I feel happier. I feel more energetic probably because I'm actually like nourishing my body with adequate amounts of food. Um, But really just, I just overall feel better in And I know that, Abby, you mentioned this. It's like, you know, these past few months have been pretty crazy in my life. And this has been like an anchor to hold on to and to kind of get me through and keep me grounded. So just in general, I just, it's been the best experience. Like I could almost cry right now. It's a new feeling (laughs) and it's amazing. So I just want to thank you both, like just for (laughs) helping me get to this place. 